Sarah Grant's family returning to Macomb County tomorrow, 15 years after her brutal murder. You're going to be joined by hundreds gathering for Tara's Walk, a fundraiser to raise money for domestic abuse victims. Hank Winchester is going to be the event of that MC tomorrow morning. Hank, it is so hard to believe that so much time has now passed. You know, Dev and Karen, we all covered that story back in 2007, and it just kind of hit me yesterday. I could not believe it has been 15 years. But tomorrow morning, uh, family members of Tara Grant, people within the community, and, and those who just want to remember her and help other domestic abuse survivors will gather in Macomb County for a very important event. Take a look. Tara Grant was a loving mother and wife. She was also secretly a domestic abuse victim killed by her own husband, Stephen, in their Washington Township home 15 years ago. Tomorrow morning, Tara's sister, Alicia, and her two children, Ian and Lindsay, will be back in Macomb County for Tara's Walk. It is absolutely so, probably the most important thing of our year um, to come back here, um, you know, and to celebrate not only pay, um, Tara's memory, but to also encourage other people to you know, watch for the signs of domestic violence to help their friends and family get out of those situations. Tara's walk is an opportunity for the community to come together to not only remember Tara Grant, her life and her legacy, but to raise money for Turning Point, a local organization dedicated to helping domestic abuse victims. I think about the happy things. I don't I don't really dwell on what happened to her. I use it as more of a message to help other people. Tara's children have little memory of what happened back in 2007, but they've come back to Macomb County every year, not only to honor their mother's memory, but to work with Turning Point. They don't want what happened to Tara to happen to other women here in Metro Detroit. Is there an emotional part of it that's tough for you? It kind of rehashes some stuff for just about like when I was younger, but at the same time, it's like, yeah, I know that's like personally a little bit harder for myself, but at the same time, if I have to go through a little bit of pain just to help a little bit, like, every, like a lot of people out, I'm 1,000% willing to do that. Tara's Walk, kicking off tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. in Sterling Heights. Uh, registration still available. You can register online this evening. You can register in person tomorrow morning. Uh, the events will kick off tomorrow around 9 a.m., but the walk itself will begin at 10 o'clock in the morning in Sterling Heights, and I hope to see you there. We're live tonight, Hank Winchester. Back to you. I hope, we hope it's a great turnout. If so you'd asked me how long that had been, I'd have lost the pool. 15 years already. I know. Yeah. Gosh, it's so hard to believe. Thank you, Hank.